testing are you there all right happy sunday afternoon everyone i hope that these are my wishes for you that you're enjoying some of the sunny weather that is here in in the area and then i also hope that you're sitting down your feet are up you have a nice pitcher of mimosa or uh, bloody mary or <laughs> Hey, even a margarita. It's, you know, nobody knows what day, what time it is or anything right now. So welcome to our Social Verted Watch Party Sale and welcome to Facebook Live and here at our store at Bernina of Naperville. So we have put together this little vignette for you because it's the easiest way that I can communicate to you what we have on sale without twirling you around the store. Plus, the store is a little messy right now, I have to admit. Our uh, classroom has been taken over by video equipment and kidding for these pin cushions. Uh, in the front of the store, there was a lot of rain here and we got like a lot of water in our windows. So we had to take all of that stuff out. But I want you to know that um, I'm excited to present to you some of these sale opportunities that we have. So let's get started. Um, I also, at the end of this video, am going to draw the name for the person who won our vintage sewing machine rally that um, we've been taking names of anybody who has like an old vintage sewing machine and we put them in a bucket and now I'm going to draw at the end of this to see who wins. And the winner is going to get free cleanings for life on the machine of their choice. Now that's free cleanings, that's not free service, but it's a great opportunity anyway. So I want you to stay tuned for that. In the meantime, our first segment that we're going to do is look at what machine bundle specials we have. And we, if you have any questions, you can certainly type in the little comments bubble under your uh, stream here, but you can also give us a call. Our phone number, da da da, is 331-472-4231. That's 331-472-4231. I should have come up with a jingle and saying that to you, but you know, <laughs> I, there's only so much time in the day, right? All right, so let's look over here. This is our Bernina 880 Plus. We've done a lot of samples on this one. In fact, we made our Bernina Swiss Patrol Clutter Catcher Pincushion on this one that you saw yesterday on our YouTube Live and our YouTube classes. So thank you, first of all, for all of you that watched that. So just to kind of give you a little wrap up of the Bernina 880 Plus, it is the largest machine in the Bernina domestic sewing machine line. There are 12 inches from the needle to the side of the machine here. It comes with everything you could possibly need. It comes with an embroidery module. It comes with a Bernina stitch regulator, which I actually have on the machine because I'm gonna show you something really cool later. Uh, it has a ton of feet. One of the main things that I have to say that I like about the Bernina 880 Plus is that it also has a little robot that threads the needle. Kid you not, if you struggle with a, one of those manual needle threaders where you have to kind of push down, wrap around, stick and pull, this one does it for you. So that's a benefit. Also, the bobbin that is in the machine it actually, when you're sewing, sits behind the needle. So when the machine bobbin is behind the needle, it means it can go really, 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 really fast. And this machine goes really, really, really fast. And I love it. I've always wanted a machine that has turbo boost and this one has it. It even has it in embroidery mode, which is pretty cool. Now, the bobbin, I told you, it's behind the needle, but guess what? You don't have to walk around this 42 inch wide machine to get to it. There are robotics in the bobbin area that flip that bobbin up to the front where you can load the bobbin without having to bend over or do anything like that. And I know these things are really hard to do right now because we're all sitting in front of the computer or the TV binge watching television or my videos hopefully <laughs> and your body has atrophied from all of the sedentary stuff so this is going to be easier for you now if you do want to build your muscles the 880 is your machine because when you pick this thing up it weighs 47 pounds so that is all that's better than kettlebell so you know think of it as a trip to the gym to help build those muscles that have atrophied during this epidemic or pandemic 
sorry. All right. Um, in addition, the Bernina, let's talk about the Bernina 880 when it's in regular sewing mode. When it's in regular sewing mode, the big features are the giant touch screen that we have. So if you have um, eyes that are a little bit like your arms are getting a little bit too short to see what you're doing, you've got a nice large screen for that. You also have multi-motion stitching. Multi-motion stitching doesn't just stitch forwards and backwards, it stitches side to side and in 16 different directions. So if we look at that, I'm gonna just unplug the stitch regulator for a moment. And you, you would basically take any stitch on the machine and you would pick a stitch. I'm just gonna pick the straight stitch, touch my little information button and pick the foot with the circle around it and it turns the screen kind of into a clock face. So when you stitch forward, it's gonna go at 180 degrees. If you wanna stitch backwards, it goes at zero degrees and any other direction like going sideways, it stitches 90 degrees, la 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 la. So that is the multi-motion stitching. And there are many, many stitches on the Bernina 880 Plus that you can stitch in these directions. I like to do this if I'm gonna put a patch on a pair of jeans. Yesterday, I had blowout. My knee came right through my jeans. It's not the COVID-19. The jeans were very, very thin. But nonetheless, I'm gonna to have to stick the skinny legged jeans into the machine and I'm not gonna be able to pivot. So I can literally stitch down, side, backwards, to the side there. And that is an amazing thing because now I've saved a $200 pair of jeans. So I can add that savings onto the price of my Bernina 880 plus. Bet you didn't think of that, did you? Didn't think so. All right, so now we also have stitches on this machine that are also programmed to be multi-motion. And any of the folders that you see in the decorative stitch column that have a cross next to it means that it's not only gonna stitch back and forth, it's gonna stitch back and forth, side to side, all over the place. There is a challenge though with this, is in the olden days, and when I say olden days, I mean like 1998, you had to sort of hold your mouth right to do these multi-motion stitches. Not on the Bernina 880. If you aren't holding your mouth right, you literally can change a dial on the machine to show it what your work looks like, and then it makes those adjustments for you. But I'm telling you, that presser foot and feed dogs work so well together that you are gonna get beautiful wide scallops, beautiful flowers, all kinds of stuff. And if you don't like stitching it out manually, you can actually embroider those little guys. So if I pick a decorative stitch, that's one of these scallops, actually I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna pick this stitch that has been on the Bernina machines since the Bernina 1630. Remember those? It had the trackball on the screen. It did the multi-motion, the nine millimeter. You had the little cartridges you inserted into the machine. Yeah, it's going back. It's going back to like the olden days, 19, the really olden days, maybe not 1998, maybe more like 1995 or something like that. I don't know. Anyway, so this stitch is a little bit tricky. So if you just want to push a button and go, you can go over to the embroidery module. And go into your cart folder and pick that stitch. And now you can embroider that stitch. You can make it larger. You can make it smaller. You can do continuous border embroidery and do one flower after the next. I love this. This is really, really pretty cool. If we journey back into our sewing machine side of things, another feature that we have, did you hear that? Those are the little stepping motors getting into place. I like to think of it as a growl or where the you know, machine is coming alive for the day. So in our machine, if we decide that we wanna just, there's, you know, there's like hundreds and hundreds of stitches on this machine, but what I like to think of is there is no person out there that can Xerox the ideas that are in my brain. So this machine has a stitch designer. So let's look at this here. So now I've got a blank slate and I can draw. And I bet all of you are wondering, hey Gail, how can I sign my quilts with my own signature with a decorative stitch on the sewing machine? So I 
literally, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna walk over here for a second. Yes, Chris is moving the camera. Say hi to Chris, everybody. Chris doesn't like to be on film at all. So he sits back there, he doesn't even say anything. All right, so I am going to sign my name on my machine. My signature is horrible, but you know, it is what it is. Let's see, so let's do That's beautiful, isn't it? So there's my signature. Oh, I can't wait to write it on a quilt. That's gonna be so awesome. Now, that's gonna be single stitching, but if I want it to stand out and really show up, because hey, if I'm gonna write my name on something, I want people to see it. So I can actually make it triple stitched and it gets super bold like that. So can you imagine how pretty and cool that would be for you to sign your projects on your sewing machine after you do them? I know that some of you make quilt labels. We can, of course, do that on a quilt label because you know there's beautiful border shapes and designs that you can do on the 880 plus. But if you just want to quickly do something, you know, just right along the edge of your quilt, a friend of mine, she signs her quilts with free motion, but she's like a virtuoso with the free motion. So this would be something that you could tweak and program to really do a good job to immortalize your work. So that is Stitch Designer. And now this is how it's going to stitch out. Now, of course, you can also save it and saving it is totally cool. And if you save your designs and you bring your machine in for an update or there's just something weird, we can also save those on a stick for you in service and then it's, it's really yours forever and ever and ever. Do we have any questions out there? I know I'm very thorough. Does anybody wanna call in and have any questions? Remember, it's 331-472-4231 Oh, I guess I'm just that good. Chris? What's in the bundle? What's in the bundle? Oh, I thought you would never ask. Okay, so our bundle firstly includes a Bernina of Naperville gift card worth $500. So this is a perfect gift card to get when you get the machine and you're not quite sure what you want yet and you kind of mull it over, you watch some more tutorials. Heaven forbid this pandemic is over and you come in for a class and need to have something. The gift card does not expire and it's just really cool and you can use it for anything in the store including service, scissor sharpening, we do that. Um, and of course your Bernina attachments and fabric. And we have so much fabric coming, you are gonna fall down and die when you see all the fabric that's coming to the store this month. So, gift card. What was the question again, Chris? The bundle. What's in, What's the, bundle? in the bundle? That's bundle. right, okay, well the gift card is in there. Then, have you ever seen anything more beautiful than a Laura Star iron? Well. This is the Laura Star Lift Iron, and this is also in the bundle, and the, the suggested price on this is $599. So already you are getting $1,099 worth of stuff with this machine. Secondly, you are going to get, da, 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 it's down here. You get luggage to carry this thing around. Now, we talked about how you're gonna get your workout to um, improve your um, atrophying muscles, but sometimes you just cannot carry the machine 500 yards from the parking lot into the store. Totally understandable. So you are get these, this suitcase, the big suitcase, and the traveling suitcase to put all of your feet, because you have that $500 gift card, so you're gonna get a lot of feet to go with that. And also the $500 gift card can work for the Bernina binder attachment, which is super duper uber popular right now. So that is our Bernina 880 plus. I hope I answered your question. Is that the only bundle we have? Well, no, it's not. Okay, let's move on to the Bernina 790 plus. Now, let me tell you a little bit about the Bernina 790 Plus. Remember how I talked about how awesome the Bernina 880 Plus is and how it has the stitch designer and it has the multi-motion stitching 
and all of these things. Well, the 790, let me tell you what the 790 doesn't have that the 880 has, and then I think you're gonna be like, well, gee, Gail, I think I want this Bernina 790 instead of the 880. So, one sad thing is that the Bernina 790 Plus does not have a Swiss robot to thread the needle. You have to do it yourself, but it's pretty easy. You know, you push the little lever down, pull it in front, slide, pull, and thread. It's just like that. We have videos, don't forget to check out our threading, maintenance, and sewing videos on the Bernina 4, 5, and 7 series machines because we do cover that, and that's at youtube.com slash Bernina of Naperville. So, you don't have a Swiss robot that threads your needle, and you don't have the swing out bobbin case, but you do have the Bernina Jumbo Bobbin, which is this right here. So now the Bernina Jumbo Bobbin um, holds, and so does the 880, but the Bernina Bobbins like these with the disco balls on them, see, that's what I'm calling disco. This holds 70% more than the average bobbin. And so you get this front loading bobbin system. And you know, this bobbin system does have its benefits because you, if you get some thread and junk stuck down in there, it's really easy to clean out. You just undo the bobbin case down there, you open up the shuttle race cover, you pull out the hook, you dust it out, you clean it out, you put it back, and then you're ready to keep sewing. And then put our bobbin case in. So that is the bobbin system and the threading system on the Bernina 790 Plus. Another thing with the 790 Plus, and you know, it's a, it's two inches smaller. This one is 10 inches from the needle to the side of the machine. But all of the machines, the, the Bernina 790 Plus and the Bernina 880 Plus, they take the jumbo hoop, they take the maxi hoop. So these are all of the things that are totally cool to be able to do your large embroideries. And we have examples all over the place. If you scroll down through our Facebook feed, you'll see how very proud I am of some of our embroidery designs we've done with the Swagger Collection. We embroidered on the back of the leather jacket. Um, I've certainly done a few samples. So that is the 790. Now with the 790, let's talk about this. You do get a bundle with that as well. See, I'm reading your mind. I know what's going through here. So with the 790 plus, you're getting a $250 Bernina of Naperville gift card, which is totally the same. You can use it on anything here in the store. That includes service, scissor sharpening, classes, windows have it again, the whole bit. Uh, and then you also are gonna get a Laura Star lift. And I don't, I only have the white one here, but we, there, this also comes in red. So if you, you know, want to tr be truly happy with your Swiss machine and your Swiss equipment, you of course are gonna want red. I mean, it's the color of lust. And honestly, this, this thing is hot and steamy. That's all I have to say. So you'll want that in either red or white. But if you know you're one of these puritanical people that have to have everything super duper clean, you'll probably want the red or the white, I mean. God, it's early. Whew, it's very early on a Sunday morning here. 1 p.m. can barely open with my eyes. All right. So the 790, we've got the Laura Star Lift, we've got the gift certificate, and da da da, we have luggage. We have the luggage bottom, the embroidery module case, and the traveling accessory case as well. So that's what you get. And I have to tell you, I, at home, back when I actually spent time at home and not in the store, I sew on a 880, for my embroidery and that because I just love the speed I love the size and all of that stuff but in my dream world I would have my 790 and my 880 so a 790 to sew on 880 to embroider on if that interests you we can we can do a thing don't you worry and I think I had another question earlier from someone this this was before the Facebook live was well Gail aren't there a lot of other Laura star options out there oh yes there are there are three lifts. There's the lift, there's the lift plus, and the lift plus comes with a telescoping holder that goes onto the iron to hold your cord up. It has a three dimensional area here that really shoots the steam like more than hot and steamy. This is fast, hot, and steamy. 
Um, and then it also has a uh, little sole plate to help keep it a little cooler if you're doing synthetic fibers. So that would be the Lift Plus, and the Lift Plus comes in super cute colors like blue, lustful red, that's the Swiss edition, uh, and black, black, blue, and red. Yeah, those are the colors for the Laura Star Lift Plus. Then there's a Laura Star Lift Extra, because you know, that is just extra to keep us on our toes, to have three different versions. So the Lift Extras have a metal protrusion on the bottom of the sole plate, and those have um, more of a matte, metallic color um, to them. Um, then, of course, there's the smart ironing system. These are, these are the ones with the board with the motor in them. You see me use it all the time in our classroom. I use the smart eye. It's got this suck and blow feature where it will either suck the steam down through the ironing board or it blows it back at you. And uh, still, hot and steamy, steaming power, love it. Um, so if you decided that you wanted to trade up your Laura Star Lift that comes in this bundle, we could also do a thing. And we have another thing that I didn't mention, but um, this is the kind of thing I'd want you to call in about or I'd want to talk to you specifically, is we are selling our Bernina Q series in the lift and in the cabinet. So these are our floor models. It's just we want to revamp some of them, and so we are ready to let these go. We also have a Q series option with the folding table. So if this is something that interests you, please give us a call because there are some financing promotions coming up next week that we can talk about. So I wanted to let you know about that. All right, anything else? Any other questions? All right, I'm gonna move on now and I wanna show you some of the other things that you're wanna, gonna wanna pay attention to. So while we're on the sewing machine track for things, I wanted to talk about the feet. So um, Bernina has a foot of the month every month and this month's foot of the month for May and this one is going to run May 1st through May 31st is the Bernina stitch regulator foot. This is the Bernina stitch regulator foot. This is how it comes in a little tin. You have your instruction booklet. Don't need it. You're going to watch the videos with me. You get the stitch regulator foot which is here on the machine and you get an open toe foot, you get a circular foot. Camilla, you cannot read, honey. Camilla wanted to get the instructions for the stitch regulator, so we're gonna put those back there. Okay, so we have the closed toe foot, we've got a puffy batting foot, which is this one, and then what's on our foot is our open toe foot. And so that's what's in there. And um, I wanted to talk, so that, I wanna to demonstrate to you the Bernina stitch regulator foot now. But I'm not gonna give you a normal demo because that's what normal people do and I am far from normal. So, um, I don't know, I don't know if you guys know about this or not, but we have a Bernina of Naperville VIP card and the VIP card don't go away, Chris, just follow me like this. We're gonna pretend like I remember to bring this over to the machine. So we have the Bernina VIP card and the VIP card comes with a lot of little perks. So the VIP card cost $500, but you get $600 worth of cash on your VIP card. That's good for anything in the store. Service, scissor sharpening, feet, classes, merchandise of all kinds, boom, all right? So when you get the foot, or when you get the card, you get the Golden Bernina foot for free. That's $125 that this foot costs. You also get um, a special gift every month. And the special gift every month is either, it's usually thread with a pack of needles. So when you buy the foot, it doesn't matter. Um, when you buy the gift card, sorry, the the um, VIP card, it doesn't matter what month you buy it in, you get a full 12 month cycle of free gifts. So the, our folks that bought in January have gotten, January, February, March, they, April, they've gotten four gifts already. So, um, and then those of you that wa are watching that have the VIP card, I'm gonna introduce this month's gift. And it is important because it goes in conjunction with the Bernina Stitch Regulator foot. 
you have any questions about this, don't be afraid to call in. Our number is 331-472-4231. And don't be afraid to exercise those little fingers on your keyboard and ask us questions. So this month's free gift is, I just like saying this word, razzle dazzle. Razzle Dazzle is a thread that is not meant to go through your sewing machine needle. It's meant to go in the bobbin area. And so you can see that it's much thicker in comparison to your regular sewing thread. So this Razzle Dazzle thread, I wound a bobbin on my Bernina 880 plus. I wound a bobbin of it and that bobbin, you can see it right there, is in the machine. Now, the th thread that comes with this when you finish doing your stitching, you are gonna need like a little darning th needle to kind of bury the thread. So we are giving you a pack of darning needles that come in a super cute case. So you're gonna get a collection of needles like this to bury your Razzle Dazzle thread. I think that right there is worth the price of the VIP card, but you know, these things are available for purchase separately. All right, so Bernina Stitch Regulator foot is on the machine, but it's not plugged in. So you have to plug this foot in, and I'm just gonna do this the most graceful way I can by pushing it in. Now, when I pop in, push in, stick in, whatever uh, semantics you wanna use, the screen changes. Now, for this thread, I teach this all the time, the thicker the thread, the longer your stitch length needs to be. So I have adjusted my straight stitch length to four on the screen, so that means it's gonna be about the longest stitch I can stitch with the Bernina Stitch Regulator foot. I have also, I'm have i also gonna be using mode number two, and I've done one more special thing. In addition to threading a thread that kinda of goes with this blue razzle-dazzle, razzle-dazzle, all right, I have adjusted my bobbin tension on my bobbin in the Bernina 880 Plus. You know, wait a minute, I just heard something. Emily is asking a question. What brand is the Razzle Dazzle Thread? It's superior. And I believe it was designed by Mr. Ricky Timms of the Ricky Timms and the Quilt Show. All right. So the Razzle Dazzle goes in the bobbin, and I'm going to show you the coolest thing you will see all day. Maybe. We're going to open our bobbin case. There comes that swing out bobbin. Isn't that awesome? And Chris, if you would be so kind as to put the camera right there. And up a little, I need to see it. There we go. All right. So now, hey, Susan, I know the blue thread matches your iron. Everybody, Susan got my iron here in the store. I had been like putting it under lock and key and hiding it and everything, but somebody came and bought my iron. It's a sad day, but guess what? Laura Star has a ton more, it's no problem. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna use our hand wheel to turn our hook around. See that? And this is actually goes in conjunction with our little tool here. It looks like it looks like an eyebrow. And do you see how it's thin there, but then it gets thicker here? So thin means less tension and thick means more tension. So normally my dot matches this dot for my regular sewing. That's how the, the 880 works with this tension. But because I'm using my super duper awesome razzle dazzle thread, I needed to click this three clicks counterclockwise. So I put, I put that on there and I go click, 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 and it goes over. Now I'm gonna show you how to click it back for regular sewing, but I wanted to show you that I'm using my multi-purpose tool with this and I'm putting this like that to adjust my tension. That's the only thing I had to do the stitch length and then the, the adjustment for this thread. And so I'm going to just take my bobbin out, close my door, because I want to just make sure we have a good experience here on live Facebook TV. And I'm opening back up. 
And then you can see my little disco, my disco sparkles come out. This is sparkly. Oh, I should be playing like, turn the beat around or something like that. All right, so we're gonna put that in. We're gonna go along this guide. Now, those of you that are familiar with the Bernina 880 Plus might also know that you can thread this for embroidery or you can thread it for regular sewing. We want a loose thread down here, so we are not gonna do that special step for embroidery. We're just gonna thread it whoop, 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 for regular sewing. It's hard because I'm usually standing where Chris is. <laughs> and actually what I also like to do, I don't like to cut when I do this. I like to kind of pull this a little bit so I have a tail to get started with. There we go. And look, I can put it in my clutter catcher. Boop, boop, boop. Very useful tool. All right, let's close. Let's put our slide on tray on. And now I've cut some material and this is gonna be our um, pretty side. So this is the side that I want to have the blue razzle dazzle on. So this is gonna be our backing side. With razzle dazzle, you are going to stitch on the back side and then turn it over and be amazed. That's how it works. So I am going to pull up my thread and I can do this a couple of ways on the Bernina 880 Plus. I can hold my thread, lower my presser foot with this button, bring my needle down with the needle down button and bring it back up again and then pull my thread up from the bobbin. And now remember, I wanna give a tail because I'm gonna use that darning needle to bury my stitches. But now I'm gonna just simply do some fancy, fancy stuff. So I'm gonna press and hold my start button. There comes my stitch regulator light and I'm just gonna fancy, fancy. So now I'm gonna stop, lift my needle up, and then lift my presser foot up and pull and leave a tail and cut. And now I would bury my threads under here, but I have a little tail at the top. But look at that pretty little sparkle feather. Think you could sign your name that way. You could do just simple cross hatching. There are so many things that you can do, but I want to make this perfectly clear how easy that was to adjust my bobbin tension for that stitch. Oh, I'm hearing a question in my head. I know somebody has it, but they're probably like not getting the spell check correctly. Gail, that was really cool and really easy to adjust that bobbin tension on your Bernina 880 Plus. But I have a question. I have a Bernina 750 or I have a 770 or I have a Bernina 4 series. What do I do to adjust my bobbin tension for razzle dazzle thread if I have a machine like this? Stay tuned. I'm back. Ah, okay. This is what you need if you are going to do couching just like I did on your four, five, or seven series machines. I call it the ketchup bobbin because it is red. There's also a mustard bobbin, which is yellow, that is the opposite of the ketchup. So you would just put your razzle dazzle in here and then go to town. Does anybody have any questions about that? Don't forget, you can call us 331-472-4231. I don't think our phone lines are jammed at all. So I bet you if you called right now, the phone would ring and I'm putting you on air because that is how I'm going to do this. All right. So, um, Chris, yes. would you mind lifting the camera off and coming a little bit closer again? 
Hang in there, everybody. All right, so what I wanna do now is I want to go back and thread this for my regular stitching. So I'm gonna undo my table so that you all can see. I would probably, well, yeah, you'd have to take your table off. I'm gonna pull out my bobbin. I'm gonna turn the bead around here. And now I'm gonna take my special tool line it up right here kick click 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 right in the center and i know on this machine this is exactly how i want this adjustment to be and then i'm just going to close my door just to let things wiggle back into place and then i'm going to open the door again and i'm loading my regular bobbin thread here and we're going to thread this for regular sewing And I'm even gonna change my thread. Now, no matter what machine that you're using, you're gonna get in the habit. Chris, you're gonna attest to this. I haven't always done it this way, have I? Say, speak. Correct. He's nodding, he's nodding, he's saying yes, Gail. He, he gets mad at me all the time, but this will help preserve your check spring on your machine. So you're gonna cut like this and then you're gonna pull the thread through like that. Is that right, honey? That's correct. Thank you, see, he does speak. All right. All right, so I'm gonna change out my black thread and I'm gonna use a, I'm gonna call this gentle feather. Did I talk about the fact that we have our isocord thread on sale? Did I talk about that? It's on sale. So you can go to BerninaofNaperville.com and search Isocord and the discount will go into your cart at checkout. You can also go to BerninaofNaperville.com and scroll past our main heading to where it talks about our social, <laughs> social verted watch party. And then there's a click where it says special products or featured products. Click on that. It talks about all of the items on sale and then it lists all of the items that are on sale. So don't forget to check that out. So I'm putting the thread on here. I'm gonna floss my machine. I call this the Bernina 880 Plus Floss. I go behind the little metal-y thingamabobby thing and then in front of the needle, and now in the little lips, under the thread cutter, I give a little slack to my thread here where I flossed it. Then this illuminated button is the one that you press. And it's threaded. Whew. All right, that was easy. That was easy. Now, I'm gonna grab a fun little piece. Oop. Okay, so this is the little block from Vintage Farm Girl. It's a milk bucket, but, but it's done with fancy fun fabrics. And so all I wanna show you, I'm gonna stipple in the white area and then I'm just gonna follow like a little cathedral windows style pattern in the rest of that bucket. And I'm gonna lower my presser foot and I'm gonna grab my thread to get I started. I wanna turn the light off so it's oh, a little bright. Oh, I can bright. do that. <laughs> Settings, sewing machine, light, off. Okay, is that better? Yep. All right, thanks, Chris. All right, so I'm just gonna start over here. I'm gonna bring my needle up and needle up again. Now I'm gonna pull my bobbin thread up. There it is, lovely. And now I'm still in my Bernina stitch regulator mode and we all know that Bernina has um, this wonderful stitch memory, but I don't wanna do my four millimeter again. So I'm gonna press clear on my machine and now I'm back at two millimeters. I'm also on, I'm still on my, um, every time I stop sewing, the needle completely stops. Well, I want to go into my 
my motif mode or mode number one. What happens between mode number one and mode number two is when I'm sewing and I stop in mode one, the needle rhythmically goes up and down. And that's if I'm gonna follow a motif and then I need to hold the material in place a little bit to tack my stitches down, I can do that. In mode two, when I stop sewing, the machine stops sewing. And that was appropriate for our heavy couching thread because I didn't wanna get that in a knot. If you get that in a knot, you have a real mess underneath. But I'm, I'm switching back to mode one and I'm gonna turn on my Bernina stitch regulator. See that needle rhythmically going up and down? So now I'm just going to do some stippling and I'm going to go all the way around my milk bottle. But look at how I can really control this machine in free motion. This is all thanks to the Bernina stitch regulator. Okay, and then I'm just gonna, oh, here, did you hear the beeping? The beeping is like the police coming after you for driving too fast. Oh my God, the popo, they're after me. Oh, remember that open, that plastic foot I was talking about? That would have been great in these areas because you go right over your, um, any loose seams or heavy seams. But I also need to see exactly where I'm going with my open toe feet. I also want to talk to you a little bit about, oh, I forgot what I needed to talk to you about. Let's just keep stippling. Okay, so we're just going along here. Now I have an embroidery needle in here, but if I were gonna do my masterpiece project, I would put in a quilting needle, probably because this particular project has a lot of seams. I would like to use a quilting size 90 needle when I go over all those little seams from this project. Here the, the police, they're after me again. It's just like real life. Chris, how's my driving in real life when I drive a car? No comment. It's better that it's not as good as my stippling. Let's just put it that way. wanted to talk to you about is do you see how I'm not pivoting my material at all that's because with free motion you don't need to it's up to you where you want to drive the material there are no roads it's like going off-roading okay so now I'm gonna stop by turning my Bernina stitch regulator button off and I'm gonna use my thread cutter and there I've done my stipple so now I wanna do just a little something fun in this nine patch area. And so I'm gonna start, so the idea is that I'm gonna do this cathedral window style quilting. And, you, and I have a special um, path that I go in to try to st not stop my thread as much. So that means I don't have to stop, break it, start in another spot, and not break it, but cut it off. So we're gonna start right here in this corner right there. So I'm gonna use my needle up down again, and then pull my bobbin thread up again. And now this time I'm gonna go, I'm gonna to try to go slowly. I tend to go really fast, just like my driving. And I don't, you know, I hardly ever need to get brakes changed in my car either, because I don't use them very often. Now, now all of my law enforcement people that are watching are gonna be looking out for me. And I don't mean looking out, they'll be watching out. All right, so I'm, I'm ready to go, so I'm gonna hit my button again. And now I'm gonna go backwards, just making a little semicircle, and I'm aiming for that corner. Now I'm gonna do the same thing. 
and aim for this other corner. Then I'm gonna aim for this corner and 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 now I'm gonna hop over and hop over and hop over now I'm gonna hop over and hop over oh there they come and hop over and go down to that corner over up down over up down over and now I'm gonna go over down up over down up over down over 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 up up and stop and cut and now we have a milk bucket cool huh all right so this is a little um, project and i'm going to trim this up and this will either be like a pot holder or I might just hang it up like laundry on a little string, but that is one example. So take a break, sip your mimosa, have a Bloody Mary sh uh, chaser, do whatever. I am gonna just grab two things and I'll be right back. Chris, maybe they'd like to see Camilla chewing her feet. And it's the cuckoo clock pattern and this is a combination of using a uh, stipple or meandering stitch and free motion stitching in conjunction with ruler work so yesterday I made that cute little pin cushion like you see here I made that on um, the Q20 and all I did was do the metallic stippling on this piece here and then I did ruler work to make the circle and then that was super cute because we had like a perfect circle that we then stuffed and made the pin cushion. Great project to just try ruler work, but what if you really want to use ruler work for what it's supposed to do? I'm going to show you how to do that. And I'm also going to show you how to do that with a domestic machine rather than the Q series because you know that guy goes so fast. It's really super cool, but some of us already have a machine like this and we just need the foot. So I'm going to put on the Bernina Ruler Work foot number 72. That's this machine right here. Machine. That's this foot right here. This is one of the feet on sale. I'm going to unplug my Bernina stitch regulator foot and I'm going to put on my number 72 foot. Now, I'm gonna tell you right now, I can't do this with that stop start button. I need the foot control. I love it, okay. So I'm gonna put that there. I'm gonna put this down here. Then I also need a ruler and I'm using, I'm just gonna do straight lines with this. So I'm using the Amanda Murphy Good Measure Ruler. The Good Measure Rulers are the best because they have the clear angle markings on here. So when I did my cuckoo, I was able to line this up on the 60 degree mark down here. So that's how I got that diamond pattern on my quilt. 
but because you have 60 inch, 60 degree markings and 90 degree markings and 45 degree markings, you can do any angle. That's, that is why it's called every angle. So I have another block, and this is out of the Vintage Farm Girl book. And oh, 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 oh. Our Vintage Farm Girl books, they got a little bit damaged in shipping. And just so you know, and these are on our website this way, they're 50% off. So they were normally like $32 or something like that. So if you don't mind having a little wrinkle in the cover or a little folded over page in the book, pick one of those up and you can make some of these cute little blocks like we have. And it also pairs well with Homestead Life, the new fabric collection we have from Wyndham. Oh, so cute. Okay, so I have my feed dogs are lowered. And my ruler work foot is on. And so I just want to do simple edge to edge cross hatching. Okay, um, but if in, in we're just going to do that just so we can get used to what a ruler work it does. So the first thing I'm going to do is lower my needle into my material. That's the growl that I just love. And I'm bringing the thread up and I'm bringing, I'm going to bring the foot up and I'm going to pull my bobbin thread up. Perfect. Now I'm going to take my ruler and I'm just going to line this up to go corner to corner, but I have to leave a space for the width of my foot. So I'm going to put my foot down, line that up, line this up right about here and now we're just going to do straight stitching now there's no stitch regulator on this so it's up to me to move and sew correctly and i'm standing up at a weird angle with a camera in my face so be nice to me and the key is to if you need to stop you stop with the needle in the down position and then readjust if you need to. Now you might say, Gail, honestly, a piece like this, can't I just put my number one foot, my number one D foot that allows for the dual feed on the machine? Of course you could. But what I'm trying to do is teach you to do these things without having to rotate if you had a larger quilt under your needle. And so I'm going to go over here a little bit. And then I'm just going to use one of these lines and I'm going to use this line right here and that's going to be this distance to my needle is what my cross hatching is going to be. So now I'm lining that up with my previous stitching line that I made. I just have to go one little stitch over. There we go. Now everything is perfect and if I were at home stitching this it would be so much easier but oh well. Now I have to stop to move my needle, or not to move my needle, to move my ruler. Ta-da! And now I've got some cross hatching, and now I'm going to come down on this side, making sure I still do the same distance away. Oh, I've got a long distance to go here. Now I'm going straight down through here. That was a little bit too close together. Okay, now we're gonna go over some more. Go over a little bit more. And now let's see if our lines line up. Excuse me. Yep, okay, here we go. But you see my straight lines that I got, and now I just need to do the other side and go around. So that would probably take a little bit more time than what you want to sit here and do, but that's what ruler work is. All right, how you doing out there? How's your Bloody Mary? How's the mimosa? How's the shot of Jack Daniels going? <laughs> All right, I'm going to cut... All 
right, so those were the feet that I really wanted to demonstrate to you because I felt that I could have done more when we were doing our little videos for the pin cushions. Oh, pin cushions. Did you say pin cushions? Let me show you the kits. So here we have our Bernina, uh, or pardon me, Swiss Patrol Clutter Catcher Pin Cushion. And so this is the little kit that comes with this. You get um, the gray for the band and the straps. And these straps were made using the number 10 edge stitch foot. So that one you might wanna pick up, this one too is on sale. And don't forget, the sale ends Tuesday evening, May 5th. And one other thing that you might wanna pick up in addition to the kit, which also includes the red, the white for the this and the white for the inside bag and the Bernina branded fabric for inside, in addition, and oh, you also get the Peltex at the top, but in addition to what's in the kit, you might wanna pick up the Bernina Edition Design CD because there are just so many totally super awesome and cool things in this design. First of all, you get all of the different machines and some of you watching, I know for sure, have had some of these machines in your lifetime. So wouldn't that be cute to make some sort of little commemorative thing with those designs on them? We also use this design to create our bag or our machine applique that we did in the hoop on our YouTube um, video a couple weeks ago. So if you check out www.youtube.com slash Bernina of Naperville, you'll see another project that we did using this. And so this guy is also available through our website. If you don't want all of the designs, I have a link on our handout section on our site to actually um, download just the one design from um, embroideryonline.com or that's OESD. Another thing that you really might like is the kit for the beehive pin cushion. So the beehive pin cushion has all of these goodies in it, including the egg base that you need. And this is the pin cushion that we made. Don't forget, we did that stump work and the stump work design is available on our class handout section to download. If you have a Bernina 880 or a 790 or even a five series embroidery machine, you can do that stump work but you will need the Bernina cut work tool and we have those as well. So don't forget, you can call us at 331-472-4231 for more information. You can comment on this feed or you can send us an email. So that is what we're looking at here. And so all of the stuff that you need is in the kit. You can also get these kits online at BerninaofNaperville.com. All you have to do is just search for Beehive and it'll boom, pop up, there it is. Finally, our little cupcake. Don't forget our cupcake that we made. High fiber, low in fat. It doesn't taste good, but you can stick it with pins. And that is from Shelly Smola's pattern that is on a CD that you can get for all the designs you can, you can put onto your machine to make one cupcake. But we also have the kit in there. So you're gonna get a roll of the um, OESD stabilizer tape. You're also going to get all little bits of material, some Pellon, uh, some batting to make one cupcake. Yes. We just had a question about what are the advantages of the 790 over the 770? Oh, there are a lot. So the 770 is, is awesome. It, it does ev almost everything that you've seen as far as how I was doing the stitch regulator, the ruler work and those things. But the benefits of the 790 is that the 790 has a much larger screen on it, as you can see here. Also with the 790, you get multi-motion stitching in regular sewing. You get the stitch designer. You don't get that on the 770. And then in embroidery, you get pinpoint placement, thread away mode, and the ability to take two embroidery designs and combine them together add the lettering with your embroidery design without the use of a computer. So I have to tell you, if you are thinking about a 770 versus a 790, I, I, would, I would go for the 790 because especially, especially for embroidery. I hope that answers your question. Um, and the 790 is coming with some goodies right now, let's be honest. All right, so those are our pincushion kits. And I talked about the VIP card. Um, we have that going on. Um, 
Then, oh, we have some other um, items on sale that we featured in our goodies. So these are just basic notions. So Isocord thread is on sale and that's every color and we carry every color of Isocord. Um, now would be a great time to stock up. We also have bobbin thread. We carry several kinds of bobbin thread and we have put all of it on sale for you. So we put the OESD bobbin thread in black and white on sale. We also put our bottom line bobbin thread on sale. Now I want to give you a little disclaimer about bottom line. If you're using bottom line bottom thread, that's by Superior, that requires your yellow high tension bobbin case if you have a Bernina 4, 5, or 7 series machine. And it requires that you adjust your bobbin on your 830, your 880 plus a little bit tighter. And I showed you how to do that. So now you're a pro at it. And when you put that bottom line in, you can just do that. Bottom line, why is there an advantage of bottom line over the other thread? Bottom line is just really thin and you can hold a little bit more thread on your bobbin with bottom line. Um, other things that are on sale is our Yen Met metallic thread. You saw me use this in the uh, demonstration for the pin cushion that we put in our Bernina Naperville mug. So all of the colors of Yen Met thread are on sale and Yen Met is a very high quality, high speed metallic thread. It's not just that the core of the thread is wrapped with tinsel. With Yen Met, it's both, it's two threads together with the tinsel wrapped in it so you get a lot less breakage and shredding when you're using Yen Met thread plus you get quite a bit on a spool. Other things that are on sale if you don't get the um, if you don't get the uh, cupcake pin cushion and get the sample roll of this uh, stabilizer tape we have stabilizer tape available we have it in tear away and wash away and both are on sale. You can't do much embroidery without stabilizer, and we have uh, different kinds of stabilizer on sale. We have polymesh stabilizer. Polymesh comes in beige, black, and white, and all polymesh in all colors and all sizes is on sale. We have Aquamesh. Aquamesh, I'm telling you right now, if I could fill a closet at my house with one stabilizer, it would be Aquamesh because we're getting ready to redesign our store inside. I know, for what? It's like redecorating for like a lady and her cats, but we're gonna do it anyway. And um, I'm gonna be using a lot of aqua mesh as I make some of these samples because Embroidery Online just came out with a beautiful free motion lace Mother's Day bouquet of flowers. And so we wanna make a lot of stuff out of that. So aqua mesh is the primary stabilizer that you use for freestanding lace or freestanding applique. It's also the primary piece that you use for um, the Shelly Smola designs. And at the end of this, I'm gonna have Chris follow me to show you some of the Shelly Smola designs. She's the one that made the 48 inch tall dollhouse. And I swear that we are gonna make this. We might have to do a time lapse of three years of my life to make this dollhouse, but we're gonna do it. Our other stabilizer, this is like the new embroiderer's best friend. This is ultra clean and tear, and it is exactly what it's described as. It is ultra and it tears clean and it comes in different sizes and it's so nice and even if you don't get out every little bitsy witsy of it it when it washes it softens up and it does not hurt your skin at all if you're like embroidering a t-shirt or a polo shirt or something like that so i love 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 ultra clean and tear and it's on sale in all the sizes um another two of my favorite pieces which would be the Rainbow Easy Cut Snippies. These are on sale. They're not that expensive to begin with, but hey, you need a break every once in a while. You've been working hard, making masks. Um, and then we've got Karen K. Buckley. I, I met her at a Bernina retreat once, and she's just the nicest person. And she was kind enough to give me a set of her scissors. And it was a smart move on her part, because honestly, I very rarely use anything else to trim out my applique designs when I'm stitching them out in the hoop. And these scissors are serrated and they're curved at the bottom so you can trim stuff really easily while they're still in the embroidery hoop. And we put these on special. And this is the kind of thing where when I buy one pair, I buy two because I need to have them in opposite ends of the planet because I, I carry something around, put it down, and then I don't see it for three months. 
Oh, 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 oh. There was a song, I don't know who sang it. It was somebody like Perry Como or something like that that had this song, hoop de doo hoop de doo I hear a samba and my troubles are through. Do you, do you remember that? No? Okay, well, sorry. So there's the scrooky doo and the scrooky doo These two things are actually really awesome, and this one is for like the three series, the 215, the Aurora line, um, all of the machines that have the little black screw that holds in the needle, this goes right over that piece so that you can tighten and loosen a little bit easier than kind of getting your little fingers in there. And this was recommended to, a, to us by one of our customers, and thank you for that because this is really an awesome piece. But the other screw key do, which is this little guy, this guy is for the 8 series and the 7 series and the uh, Q series. And what I like about these is even though I have that little piece that comes with the machine, I, we usually keep it here in the freehand system, <laughs> but um, it's just a little one. This one's larger and I just feel like I can quickly take the needle in and out. So these items are available. There's also a hoop key do. It's purple and it's made to undo the screw on your hoop. So these hoop key do, screw key do items are also on special. And last but not least, and if there's something I've forgotten, don't forget to go to BerninaofNaperville.com and scroll down to our social birded watch party sale and you can click on the featured items and there'll be a list of all of the things we have featured that are on sale. Look at this guys. This, I bet you really, you don't want the pin cushion, you want this mug. And we talked about this yesterday on our social birded watch party. So here's the thing. This mug is awesome because you can pour your Baileys in here, then your coffee, and then you even have a little spoon to stir it up a little bit. So that's really cool. It's dishwasher safe. It's blue. It's a constant reminder that Bernina of Naperville is here and wrapping you up in coffee, alcohol, and fabric and machines and everything and, have, and maybe be a place of humor and comfort during this horrible time that we're living in. And by buying a Bernina of Naperville mug for $9.99, you are saving a starving bulldog. That's right, Camilla. She eats more than any other 45 pound dog I've ever seen. Look how sad she is. In the arms of the angel, fly away from here, from this sad sewing store and the emptiness that you feel. You got, you got the idea, right? Poor Camilla, she needs dog food and these mugs can help keep Camilla in her very expensive, grain-free, non-pelletized, the honest company food. I know, a tear came to my eye too. All right, so um, I think that just about wraps it up for us. Uh, I'm so glad that you tuned in, and uh, I, heaven forbid, I'm gonna save this video so you can watch it. I must be a brute for punishment or something, but Thank you for hanging in there. Thank you for being a customer. And thank you for giving us your hard earned money because I know that's not really easy to do in these times. And I can't tell you there's no one here that appreciates it more than Camilla. So thank you very much. I will see you soon. And we're open Monday for a curbside pickup. But if you get anything today, it'll be ready for you 10 a.m. sharp tomorrow out on the curb.